What's up guys, Computer MD of Gilbert here, and today I am going to show you an intro to the Wix HTML editor. Uh, from now on, uh, as far as tutorials go, I'm going to be doing a whole bunch of Wix tutorials uh, because there is a bunch to do and I have gotten great feedback from them, so why not keep helping everybody out? <laughs> Okay, so here in front of me, um, you see this is a template. Uh, Wix has thousands of templates you could go check out. Uh, and I'm starting from right after you would get a new template. So you'll see over here on the side, Pages, Design, Add, App Market, and Settings. These are going to be your main uh, sections that you would click on to add things, to subtract things, to change design of things, to change or add or remove pages, all that type of stuff. So over here is going to be your life source, I guess you could say. So you need to know uh, to go over here whenever you're looking for something to add or input or delete. Now, the next part is if you ever get in a case scenario where you messed up on something and you don't want to go and delete the entire site, Wix has created an undo button and a redo button. So if you miss a step or you added something you didn't want to, go ahead and click that undo button and it will go back a step. And that is awesome, especially if you mess up on something. I know I have before and it gets very irritating. So you just go to that. Now, there's a few more buttons you're going to need to know as an intro to the Wix HTML editor, and that is going to be your save button. Whenever you're ready to save your site, and I would always recommend after a change or two, or maybe a few changes, to always save your site. That way you know you'll never lose anything. And sometimes Wix, sometimes Wix could recover your site if you accidentally did X out or your computer restarted or shut down, something like that. Um, but always save your work. Uh, you never want to lose that. Then your preview button is for you to preview your website. If I click that, it'll let you preview your website, how it would look to the general public if someone went to your website right now. And it just shows you how it would look and the functions that you have in there and the buttons that you have. You can make sure everything works. That's a good thing to check before you go and publish your website, which is the next button I'm going to show you. This is your publish button. You will click this whenever you are ready to publish your site. And see, before you publish, it's going to ask you to save your work and name your website. So name your website, whatever you want your website to be named. Go through that process and just click publish. It's that easy. Um, and when you publish your website, it goes live. Now, you do have an option to publish your website without it being live, which means not everybody could see it. Uh, you have a special link for people you want to see it. Uh, one last thing that you're going to need to know as far as the HTML5 editor goes is over here, it's get feedback. So you could ask friends, family, whoever you want to see your website, business partners, uh, to go on there and look at your website and you could share the site with them and they could add little comments here and there uh, next to things on your website saying if they like it, if they don't like it, if you should add something, if you should subtract something, all of that. Uh, so... As of right now, that is a basic intro to the Wix HTML5 editor. I will be going into depth on all of these things over here, pages, design, ad, app market, settings, all of that. And there's tons and tons of more tutorials to come with this Wix HTML5 editor. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this little intro. Uh, if you did, drop me a like button down below. Don't forget to comment if you have any questions or if you'd like to uh, just spark up a conversation, please do. And also, don't forget to subscribe because I am going to have an entire Wix tutorial series coming. And I'm already starting to add them into the playlist, which I will put in the description below. Alright guys, that is it for this video. Uh, I will be posting a Wix tutorial every single day. So make sure you check back every day to go help you with your website. Alright guys, I'll catch you on the next video.